And we begin with developing news tonight. Pierre Part Elementary School is closing its doors for the school year a bit sooner than expected. Tomorrow will be the last day of school and Fox 44's TC Muzinga joins us now to tell us why the school system is closing the school's doors early. Ticia. Yeah, Chad Lauren, good evening. Imagine going through this every single day just to drop your child off to school. Many roads in the area are still underwater after all the heavy rain we've seen in the past month. Week. We've been uh, sandbagging. This is Eugene Blanchard's life in Pierre Parr. When it rains, it pours, and once the rain stops, the water still sticks around. This is how high the water is in the area. Drivers have to slow down a few miles outside of the city just to get into the city. And when you arrive in Pierre Parr, more water. You can see the parking lot of this subway flooded. It's the south wind that kills us. The south wind blows off of Lake Verret and just fills up all the back backwoods and uh, around our houses. All of this water, which is slowly receding, grabbed the attention of Ascension Parish Superintendent Jeremy Cuvion. Today, he announced students at Pierre Parr Elementary School will get an early start to summer vacation. Students and teachers' last day is Tuesday rather than Thursday. And buses will not run in this community after school ends for the year. You can, you can go right down the road and you can see where there's water in the edge of the parking lot. I reached out to Superintendent Cuvion for comments but didn't get a response. The school system did release a statement warning parents that Assumption High School will run a full day Tuesday so students can finish their final exams and all other schools in the parish will run as scheduled. If students still can't make it to school safely, they will be excused. It's a solution for students and teachers, but people like Blanchard are still waiting for theirs. There's a project going on right now, the Bayou Chain project, and uh, if that was completed, we wouldn't have a problem right now. I did reach out to John Boudreaux, the director of Assumption Parish Office of Emergency Preparedness, about the Bayou Shane project, and he says the project recently received federal funding to move it forward. For Fox 44 News, I'm Ticia Muzinga. Ticia, thank you, and the project is expected to be completed by 2022.